So today I wanted to do the same thing that I did with my uh, little niece and nephew and I already have it all prepped and prepared. So let's start. Alright, so I used a green, a yellow, and a white. I didn't want it to overpower the the canvas because the other one that I did, holy moly, I decided to do all of the colors of the rainbow and let's just say it turned to brown. <laughs> and so I'm not going to show you guys that because it, it's just red and brown. Everything mixed, everything went everywhere and <laughs> you guys don't need to see that. I'll probably show like how I fix it later, <laughs> but it's it's just terrible. It like it pulled up. It was the first time of me trying it, so it was just terrible. And so now I'm actually <laughs> just leaving it in a corner to fix it later. <laughs> and this one I didn't have any of the pouring medium left so I decided to do a watered down black into the crevices of the canvas and towards the color so that that way I had it completely colored and I'm happy I did this because I could kind of like turn it around and see where I truly wanted to put the character and where I wanted the balloons to go and everything. I was going to make her look up, but I didn't know at the time that I was going to put balloons. So that's why she's kind of looking at her hand, like she's looking at the string rather than balloon. And the other little uh, piece that is behind her was going to be her hand, um, her other arm. But I decided to make that into her hair. Now she would have had a short hair. And then her dress, I decided to make furlies out of it so that you would see more dimension. And I did wait for it to kind of dry so that I could paint it with blues and like show you the little frills in between. I did love the, the black concept into the entire piece, but I felt like it needed a little, a little color in it. Because if not, I would have done the entire thing in actual color, but nah, she's like in the outside of the world trying to step in. So the balloons and her are just going to have that blue in it, but not truly get that green in those other tones. Oh, and then I got all mad, because once it dried, all the yellow that I put into it turned into like a light, um, a light green. So all the yellow is gone. <laughs> and it makes me laugh because that was the one that had the most color of it all. So, <laughs> that poor green, or I mean that poor yellow, is all gone. And see, you can see all the frills of her dress. And it's going up. See, and I really love that. I do not know why. I just love this painting. And putting brown for her hair. She has a lot of hair. And there we go. It is all done. Look at this balloon. And look at her. So pretty. And thank you again, you guys, for waiting this long. Please like, share, and subscribe if you love this one as well. And tune in next week for another project. Alright, thanks! Bye!